Welcome. I'm Michael Gill, and I'm delighted to be your host for this course based on my book, How to Think Like Leonardo da Vinci, Seven Steps to Genius Every Day. The course takes you through the mind of history's greatest genius and shows you how to apply his methods to enrich the quality of your life by thinking more creatively. Born just outside Florence on April 15, 1452, Leonardo da Vinci lived through a series of pandemics, including one in Milan that killed about 30% of the population. Leonardo's life and work can't be fully appreciated without an understanding of the effects of the plague on the consciousness of the time. Known as the Black Death, the plague was the critical catalyst that gave birth to the Renaissance. It began in 1347 and spread across Asia and Europe with devastating consequences, especially in Italy. Outbreaks continued in Europe for the next 400 years. This scourge led people to question the rigid belief structures and superstitious mentality that had dominated Europe for a thousand years. It awakened a profound curiosity and a passion for exploration. People began to ask new questions, questions that gave birth to unprecedented artistic achievement, innovation, the emergence of this scientific worldview, and a radical transformation of, of our idea of individual human potential. We're shooting this video in the spring of 2020 as the corona pandemic rages throughout the world. Although it's a frightening time, humanity is much safer thanks to the pioneering work of innovators like Barton, Lister, Nightingale, Pasteur, Semmelweis, and many others. Hundreds of years before those scientific and practical stalwarts, Leonardo da Vinci championed the notion of better hygiene as a means to prevent the spread of infection. The cramped housing, overcrowded, filthy streets of Milan appeared to him as breeding grounds for contagion and inspired his remarkable city planning drawings and designs that promoted much greater sanitation, efficiency, and beauty. There's no better time to invoke the genius of Leonardo da Vinci for your life and for our society. If humanity is going to transmute the suffering we are currently experiencing into a new renaissance, it will be through our powers of creativity and innovation. This is your invitation to be part of the new renaissance. It's time to wake up and think creatively. What many people don't realize is that Leonardo left specific instructions on how his students can awaken their creative powers. The young Leonardo wrote, I wish to work miracles. I spent years decoding his miraculous teaching and translating it into contemporary terms so you can apply it in your life now. The Genius Mastery Team has crafted a beautiful, high quality video program that will guide you step by step on how to think like Leonardo. We were planning to release it later in the year, but we've been improvising to get it to you sooner since the lessons of the course are so critically important now. Many of our friends have lost their jobs and many businesses and professions are undergoing grave difficulties. Now is the time to think more creatively about how to rise to these challenges. So while we look forward to getting back into our wonderful professional studio, we decided to improvise and offer you this informal version of the introductory chapters as our gift. I hope you enjoy it, and I look forward to guiding you through the mind of the greatest genius of all time.